In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to block ads in your new Fluid app. The first thing we want to do is go ahead and open a browser and navigate to this page, mytechadventures.com slash go slash usercontent.css. And it's case sensitive, so make sure that you capitalize the C. Hit enter, and you'll get a page that looks like this. So the next thing we want to do is go ahead and open our Fluid app, which we made in part two using the paid version of Fluid. If you completed the last tutorial, your Fluid app should open up here in the status bar. I'm going to go ahead and open it, and you can see that our Facebook page has plenty of ads over here on the right. So what we're going to do is select all on this page, copy it, and then we're going to go into where our preferences are on our Fluid app by right-clicking the icon. But we're not going to go into preferences. Instead, we're going to go into user styles. We're going to add a user style over here. And we're going to call it add blocking. And we're going to make sure that these rules are enacted on any Facebook page. And you can also add other pages to block ads on Google. So if you had a Gmail Fluid app or any other type of Google page as a standalone Fluid app, it would also block ads on those pages. And then we're going to go down here. We're going to erase what's in here already and paste in what we copied from this page. Now we can see that we have the ad blocking user style added. It's going to be enacted on these pages, and here's our code. You can go ahead and close that, check out our Facebook page, reload it, you can see that the ads are gone. 